With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, today's question is the statement one they given the number of days of choosing 15 couples out of 15 women and 15 men is they given 1 to 4. So we have to uh, check whether this uh, given answer is right or not. The statement to they are given the number of ordered pair of integer x comma y which satisfy the equation y square plus 6y plus x square equal to 4 is 8. So we have to check whether the given statement is true or not. So first of all, let's move to the answer. First step, I am going to take the statement 1 here. So statement 1. Okay, questions statement one. So in our question, there there are fifteen women and fifteen men. Okay, questions. So fifteen men and fifteen women. Okay, questions. So here we have to choose the fifteen couples. Okay, questions. Couple. So one by one man and one woman. We have to get it. Okay, so we have to choose. Okay, questions. So fifteen. Okay, questions here. Total 15 men are there. Total 15 is there. So here from 15, we, we need to choose one, right? And from 15, we need to choose one. So it is in the product form. So therefore, 15 C1 into 15 C1. So the value equal to 15 square, right? So, so remaining 14. Each individually 14 members are there. So from 14, we have to choose one. From 14, we have to choose one. So like that, it is 14 square and 13 it is equal to 13 c1 into from 13 one candidate so it is 13 square so up to so on so therefore therefore this condition here it is in the form of summation of n square so it is in the summation of n square going taken so r equal to so where R equal to 1 to n I'm going to take a name. So we know that the formula. So summation of R equal to 1 to n. n square formula equal to n into n plus 1 into 2n plus 1 whole divided by 6. Okay, so therefore I'm going to substitute the value here. So the n value equal to 15. Okay, so here why? Because the total value equal to 15, right? So maximum value equal to 15. So 15 into 15 plus 1 16 into 15 2 so 30 plus 1 31 divided by 6 okay so, so 3 2 so 6 3 5 so 15 2 1 so 2 2 9 so 18 sorry 2 8 so 16 it is 2 8 so 16 2 9 so 8 so 2 8 so 16 therefore if i multiply this one if you multiply this one we will get 1 to 4 0. Okay, so therefore, if we see here, yeah, so 1 to 4 0, statement 1 is correct. Okay, so therefore, statement 1 is correct. Next, I am going to take the statement 2 here. So, statement 2. Okay, so now. The given equation they are given. So they are given the one equation here which satisfies the number of pair here. Okay, so, so the value equal to y square plus 6y plus x square which is equal to 4. So this is the given value. So y square plus uh, y square plus 6y plus x square equal to 4. Now I'm going to add the 9 value on both sides. So just I'm going to add 9 value on both sides. So it will be kept same, right? So y square plus 6y plus 9 plus x square equal to 4 plus 9. Okay, so therefore this value is equal to y plus 3 the whole square. The formula y plus the whole square formula equal to y square plus 3 square 9 into 2 into a b. So 2, 3 is so 6y plus here this x square value equal to 4 plus 9 equal to 13. Okay, so, so here, here the radius value, here the radius value equal to, here it is in the form of circle equation. Here this 
equation in the form of circle equation therefore radius equal to radius equal to 38 and circumference circumcenter equal to circle circle center equal to here minus 3 comma 0 okay so here this 13 i am going to write in this format 4 plus 9 okay so here i'm going to write 4 plus 9 right so here this value equal to 2 square plus 3 square right 2 square plus 3 square i'm going to turn like this okay so therefore this each and individual value is equate this term okay so therefore i'm going to turn here y plus 3 the whole square equal to 2 square and y plus 3 the whole square equal to 3 square okay so and here x square x square value i'm going to equate with both okay so therefore plus x square sums rules and x square equal to 2 square x square equal to 2 square and x square equal to 3 square so each and every individual value which is equating these two values here okay so, so i'm going to find the value here so now i go here square square i'm going to cancel and i'm going if i'm going to take square root on both sides so square square cancel here therefore it will become plus or minus 2 so why are three value are going to that side so here if, if it is plus 2 this value equal to minus 1 right so it is equal to minus 1 if it is minus 2 so minus 2 minus 3 value equal to minus 5 right so the value equal to so this is the one value here we will get here okay so this is the one value next i am going to find the another value here so here y plus the, the whole square equal to 3 square right so i am going to take the square on both sides so it will be kept y plus 3 equal to plus or minus 3 so i am going to the value i am going to take this 3 value that side so if it is plus 3 plus 3 here minus 3 so it equal to 0 if it is minus 3 here minus 3 minus 6 will come so here also two values here so i'm going to find the values of x square equal to 2 so i'm going to take the square root on both sides so it will become x equal to plus or minus 2 and here if i take square root on both sides it will become x equal to plus or minus 3 so here this value so far for two square value it has two and two values so it has two values for two square for y value it has two coordinates for x coordinates also it is two plus and then three three coordinates for three coordinates it has two values right so two way values and three coordinates here for three square value it has three values so it has two coordinates therefore the value equal to two two sub four plus two two sub four which is equal to eight okay so therefore the statement 2 is also true okay so therefore statement 2 is also true statement 2 is true okay so therefore statement 1 also true and statement 2 also true and statement 2 is not the correct expression for statement 1 okay so thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today